Rizzo here. Welcome back to my channel. Today, ipapakita ko sa inyo yung aking mga favorites for the month of February. February? Wala ako masyadong energy today kasi hindi ako na coffee. But that's alright. Let's go ahead and finish this video. So, itong video na to, iba siya sa ibang favorites video ko. Kasi yung favorites video ko, favorites lang talaga siya. Now, I will show you guys my regrets as well because I have a few. But let me know if gusto nyo yung ganitong video. Yung my favorites at regrets. Anyway, let's go ahead and start sa mga favorites ko. First one is the Milani Conceal Plus Perfect Foundation. This I really like. I was so close to featuring this on my 2016 Beauty Favorites video. I actually like it more than my Too Faced Born This Way Foundation, which is the foundation that I featured in my 2016 Favorites. Do not get me wrong, I really like that. That performs really good. I like the shade, match me perfectly. This one matches me perfectly as well. I just feel like, like this is more natural looking. I'm not saying that that is not natural looking at all. This is just more natural looking para sa akin. It provides medium coverage. You can build it up to a uh, full coverage. Very lightweight. I have a review on this. I will leave the link below if you guys are interested. But that's the first favorite. Next one is a powder. This is the Mary Kay Translucent Loose Powder. I use this on my Jamsu makeup technique. This is the only translucent powder that I like so far. I have used the Austral... No, I don't think I've used the Australis. I think I've tried it once and I wasn't blown away. So I tried this and I was like, oh, this is good. Hindi siya kagaya ng ibang translucent powder na sobrang puti tingnan sa mukha ko. This one is translucent talaga siya as soon as na-blend mo na siya. Very fine ng powder. I got this from Syra May on Instagram. I will leave the links below. And also, this is a really good powder because it has a... Um, do they call it sifter? I think it's sifter. Pero meron siyang ganito, which opens and locks. I don't know if you saw that at all. Kasi puno na siya ng powder. Pero maganda siya kasi it's not messy. Because of the locking mechanism. Char, my locking mechanism. Basta nalalock siya, guys. Okay, next one is this. This is the Sephora Highlight Low Light Face Contour Duo. I don't use the um, highlight. I only use the contour. I actually have it on my face right now. This is the very first contour cream that I have used. So I really cannot compare. It hindi nga lang siya ganun kadami yung product niya. Like, tingnan mo, ganito na lang kadami yung contour powder. Because no, not powder. Contour stick. Because I use it all the time. And um, the highlight, tingnan natin kung gano'ng kalaki. Hello, sira yung highlight. Ay, sira yung highlight. Nakakaloka. Hindi siya yung highlight na kagaya nung Becca na highlight ha. Par lang siyang, par lang siyang mas lighter sa contour. Pero it's matte. Hindi siya po provide ng shimmer at all. Okay. So, and then for mascara, I have been loving this LOL mascara. I actually have uh, Maganda Ba Ang Mura featuring LOL Cosmetics. So all LOL Cosmetics. And this is one of the products there that I said I like. And yes, I still like it. I wear it on natural days like today. So I have it on my eyelashes right now. It's not super Vava Boom looking like my Maybelline Pumped Up Colossal and my Etude House Girl Fix. Pero I like it because again, on natural days, it just gives life to your eyelashes pero not like too much, you know? Para lang hindi hubad. Hubad! Yun! Para lang hindi hubad tingnan yung eyelashes mo. Time na to remove your makeup. Hindi siya mahirap tanggalin which is good kasi yung curl fix ko, my gosh, kailangan ko talaga ng waterproof eye makeup remover para matanggal siya. And ito, ano lang, okay lang na mag facial wash ako kasi hindi siya mahirap tanggalin at all. So very easy lang siya. I like it. For the brows, I have been loving, guys, my Benefit Goof Proof Brow Pencil. I have mine in the shade number 4. I have it on my brows right now. Hindi ako mahilig sa mga brow pencils at all. I have always been a brow powder brush kind of girl. Pero when I started using this, it's not hard to work with at all. Na try ko na yung Etude House. At first, nagustuhan ko siya. Pero habang tumatagal, hindi ko na masyadong nagustuhan yung Etude House na ano ba tawag doon? Basta same na ganap dito. Ito, very easy to blend. Gusto ko din yung spoolie niya kasi manipis lang. Ah, hindi manipis. Like, maliit na yung spoolie niya. Hindi kagaya yung iba laki ng spoolie. Parang over naman. Na mamess up na yung brows mo sa laki ng spoolie. Ito, perfect lang yung size ng spoolie niya. Okay, lip products. I have two right here. The first one is the KJM Cheek and Lip Tint. This is in the shade 
Bittersweet Magenta. I have three with me. I think I have the Pink Puff and then I forgot the other shade. But ito yung shade na lagi kong ginagamit. I like it if ayo ko mag-lipstick and gusto ko lang na alive. Tingnan yung mukha ko. So I always go for KJM. I was gonna do a KJM lip swatches and review for you guys. But wala na sa akin lahat ng shades. I gave away some sa kapatid ko. Pero gustong gusto ko sila. The formula is very on point. Hindi siya sticky at all. Okay na okay siya. At first lang, hindi ako marunong mag-apply ng lip tint. <laughs> Kasi hindi naman talaga ako mahilig sa lip tint. Pero, nung nagamit ko na to, parang nakahiligan ko na siya. Again, kapag hindi ko gusto mag-lipstick, ito na yung ginagamit ko. So, what I do is I apply it. Roller ball pala yung applicator niya. So, what I do is I apply it all over my lips. Tapos, I blend it using my pinky. Yun yung, uh, for me, the best way to apply lip tints. And it stays all day. It's really good. And hindi tsaka yung taste niya. So, I recommend kay JM Lip Tints. And hindi ko pa alam kung kailan ito maubos kasi tingnan nyo naman guys. Ang dami pa oh. Okay, next lip product is this Minow Kiss Proof Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick. I have mine in the shade 205. I got this because of Kim of Kim's Collections 2015 PH. Nagpunta kami ng DV and she told me I really like that liquid lipstick. Yan yung pinaka the best liquid lipstick na nagamit ko. So I was like, okay, I will go ahead and try it. So I got this shade and the other shade as well na one time ko palang nagamit yung shade na yun. Ito yung shade na lagi kong ginagamit. Ito na yung go-to liquid lipstick ko, guys. I have it on my lips right now. If I want something nude and gusto ko na mag-last siya, I always go for this because this is very long-lasting. After isang kainan, okay na okay pa din siya. After dalawa, medyo na-fade na siya, pero still good. Again, hindi ko alam kung FDA approved siya. I don't use it all the time though. Kasi nga hindi ko sure kung safe siya gamitin. Pero ginagamit ko lang siya kung, again, gusto ko na mag-last yung lipstick sa lips ko na I don't have to worry about oh, ano na itsura ng mukha ko. You know what I mean? Kapag nag-set na siya, nandun na talaga siya, mahirap na siya tanggalin. Ito din, nakakaloka din to. Kailangan din talaga na makeup remover para matanggal siya or like kung wala ka mang makeup remover like i-rub mo talaga ng bongga yung lips mo para matanggal siya. Hindi siya ganun kadali itanggal. Itanggal! Hindi siya ganun kadali itanggalin. <laughs> then, okay, next one will be the last favorite and then yung mga regrets ko. So next is RMK Whitening Deodorant. Some of you guys have been asking me kung I still use it. Yes, I still use it. Ito na yung deodorant ko. Araw-araw, twice. You're supposed to use this twice a day. Minsan nakakalimutan ko siya. Most of the time, naalala ko siya. So, pag gabi, when I'm doing my skincare, inaano ko din siya yung aking kilikili. Tinitake care ko din yung aking kilikili. Pero minsan talaga nakakalimutan mo. And I have been using this, hindi ko alam, two months na siguro. And ganyan na siya kadami ngayon. Sobrang init sa Pilipinas, ba? Very humid. I started using this nung nasa Pilipinas pa ako eh. Hindi talaga nagpapawis yung kilikili ko. Like, wala akong baskil talaga kapag ito yung ginagamit ko. And I really like it. Wala siyang amoy, pero hindi nangangamoy yung kalikili mo kapag siya yung gamit mo. So, I'd rather have walang amoy at all kaysa sa mabaho. You know what I mean? So, gustong gusto ko siya. And ang ganda niya sa feeling. Kasi like, hindi talaga basa, hindi moist sa feeling yung um, kilikili mo kapag ito yung gamit mo. And I really like it. Mayroon akong tatlong extra or tatlo or dalawa. I think tatlo. Mayroon akong tatlong extra US. That would last me a long time. Thank you so much. Nakuha ko to from a uh, seller sa Cebu. Talamban Cebu. Ililip ko yung link nila below. Pero product siya, I believe, ni Sis Maffy. So, yeah. RMK deodorant very good, very good. I like it. Okay, now sa mga regrets. Meron akong tatlo dito. Magsastart ako sa lipstick. Ito, LOL lipstick. Again, na-feature ko na sa Maganda Ba Ang Mura. I don't like it. I don't like the color. Hindi din siya long-lasting at all. After isang kainan, nawala na. Nawala na yung lipstick. Very flimsy din na packaging niya. Ito yung shade 05. Think pink. Hindi din siya ganun ka-pigmented. Like, see? Hindi din siya ganun ka-pigmented. And then, another LOL product is this. LOL Smudge Proof Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. So, sabi nila smudge proof and waterproof daw. Pero hindi siya smudge proof at all. Hindi ko na-test yung waterproof kasi isang beses ko pa lang ito nagamit nung review lang. And nagbibitak-bitak siya. Siguro mga 5 minutes after ko siya in-apply, nagbibitak-bitak yung eyeliner which is a no-no. At saka kaya tignan kapag nagbibitak-bitak yung eyeliner mo. Okay lang naman siya pag-apply. Yung applicator niya is not bad at all, okay lang. Pero, yung product itself, nagbibitak-bitak after 5 minutes. So, I don't like it. And then, the last product that I'm gonna show you guys, ito, kakaloka. W Hair, ito, W Hair, epilator, whatever. 
I don't like this. Hindi siya nagwa-work. Yung naka-attach sa kanya ngayon is yung pangtanggal ng kalyo. Sometimes ginagamit siya ni Dan, pero sabi ni Dan, it's really nothing special. Like, okay lang, maganda sa feeling. Pero hindi siya like, mind-blowing na, oh my gosh, ang kinis na ng ano. No. Pero hindi ko siya binili para, para dito sa pangkalyo, kaloka. Binili ko siya because of the epilator head. Kasi naghahanap ako ng bagong epilator. Kasi yung epilator ko, iniwan ko sa Philippines. Yun yung Philips na epilator, guys. That is way better than this. Way better than this. Get the Philips. It is more expensive. If you're looking for an epilator, go for the Philips one. Yung maliit. Siguro pink na yung color nila ngayon. Yung sa akin kasi yung old one gray. Pero Philips is way better. This doesn't epilate at all. Like, wala siya nakukuha ang hair. Hindi niya nag-grab yung hair. So, it's like, hindi ko alam kung defective lang itong specific head na to. But it doesn't grab hairs at all. Tinry namin siya sa arm ni Dan. And yung arm ni Dan has super hairy. And I know how to use epilator. I have been using an epilator for years. So, I know how to use it. This one just doesn't work. Na-feature ko na to sa vlog ko. Sabi ko, don't buy this. Because guys, hindi siya mura. 2,500, 2,600 to. Meron siya itong shaver. And I use the shaver for quite a while. Kasi nga yung epilator ayaw mag-work at all. So, wala akong choice, kundi gamitin yung shaver nila. But still, hindi ko gusto na mag-shave lang sa kinikili ko kasi iba talaga kapag epilator. Kapag epilator, nakukuha talaga yung mga buhok and kapag shave, feeling ko kinabukasan may buhok na naman, may nafe-feel na naman ako na I don't like it. If you're looking for an epilator na sa Pilipinas kayo, go for Philips kasi yung Philips maganda, maliit, Okay na okay. And that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Again, let me know kung gusto nyo na ganito na yung gawin ko sa monthly favorites ko. Like, gawin ko na siyang monthly favorites and regrets video. So yeah, please like this video if you enjoyed or if you found the video helpful. Please subscribe if you haven't already. I hope to see you guys on my next one. Do not forget me. Goodbye. Please like if you enjoyed or if you found the app. I need coffee. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please you, please you like you. <laughs> please like this video if you enjoyed or if you <laughs> Please like this video if you enjoyed or if you found this video helpful.